All right. Here we go with this crap. Man. Oh, gonna start leveling up the... The Ember set. All right. Let's get started. Oh. So it begins. Probably gonna let all the cutscenes play the first time, for the record. Well, we're fucked. I need to mute my computer. There we go. Well, we're fucked. Ugh. <sighs> Against all the evil that hell can conjure. All the wickedness that mankind can produce. We will send unto them only you. Rip and tear until it is done. Signal locked in. The target is marked, but the signal will not hold for long. For it is he that they fear, not man. For his armies, they fear the mark of the beast. It begins. I have located the first signal. I will mark it on your HUD. Alrighty. And yes, I want to be able to beat Ultra Nightmare collecting everything.
All right, first battle. Let's go. Yeah, basically from what I learned, just the grenade, just the sticky bomb for the shotgun is like the best thing you have right now. I mean, you start off so weak in the beginning that you need to inflict as much damage as possible. Because you don't have your dash, you don't have any runes, you don't have your flame belch. Don't have any of that. I'm regular nightmare. That's dope. So far, beating the game on Ultra Nightmare is like the only, is like the only milestone that I have left, believe it or not. I've already ran through this entire game a second time on Extra Life Mode. But I just want to be able to beat Ultra Nightmare. Oh yeah. But dope, that's awesome. Congrats. I mean, I was able to get past- I did just start on Ultra Nightmare for the hell of it. I died like three times before I managed to get past the first level. Just because of how ridiculous the amount of damage you take. Like, did you just start on Nightmare on your first time through? Because if you did, then that's insane. I was I didn't have the I didn't have the balls to do Ultra Nightmare on tw on Doom 2016. But I mean I want to be able to do it this time. On this one. Okay, here we go. You. Son of a bitch. I usually chainsaw when I panic because I know I can't get hurt. That gives me a chance to like recompose myself and then I fucking fall off. Of course I do that. Because trust me, I kind of go into panic mode a lot. Even though I know I need to keep my cool. Shit, shit, shit. See, it's this kind of bullshit right here. Okay. I, I'm lucky to be alive, truthfully.
thank God. Whew. Truth be told, I have no idea how the fuck I'm gonna do the Icon of Sin fight. That's the one thing I'm worried about. Okay, I have no idea what happened there. That grenade exploded and it didn't hurt any of them. Okay. See, normally it takes me about three or four tries before I'm able to even get past this area. And yes, as you can see, I do play with the classic weapon pose. Because I'm weird like that. Okay. Yeah, it's just so traditional. I just love it just because, like, oh. I'm so glad they kept that in this game. Shit. And there's one thing I learned when they fire that shit out of their, out of their sides. Don't go back in that direction. I learned that the hard way. Let's say. Couldn't tell if I was up there or not. Also, I want those I want these figures in real life. Like I'm willing to like empty my shelf to for figures like those. I would totally collect all of them. I don't care how much they cost. I'd totally be down for that. guy right here yes yes I'm aware that there are already speedrunners for this game and they don't do glory kills but I mean like I only do it because not only does it help me move and it gives me distance it just gives me invincibility as well I know that puts me at risk at some points, but like getting glory kills like save my ass, you know, especially when I get on low health or something. And also there are no one ups in Ultra Nightmare either. They're replaced with like armor pickup. They're pi they're replaced with like mega spheres. Like where you would see a one up on Ultra Nightmare mode, um you would see a uh you'd see like Something that works like a mega sphere, basically. Okay. I mean like I'm not gonna I'm not gonna be like that guy that's just like that just like tells people how to do anything. They're just better at the game than I am, pretty much. Fucking hell. Why'd that be happening? Hey, bastard. Yeah, I know the Icon of Sin is gonna give me trouble. Oof. Like, unless there's, like, a really fast way to damage him that I'm unaware of. Like, the thing is, though, whenever he tries punching, 
I mean, like, I never tried hitting him with the Crucible or the Blood Bunch. For all I know, the Blood Bunch could be, like, the most powerful thing you get out of him. When it comes to dealing damage. Fuck. Don't like being cramped in like this. Okay. Okay, honestly, I feel like I should not have survived that. Yeah, screw those. Okay, now we got the, the Arachnatron right here. Fuck, and I missed it again. Oh, that actually took the turret off. I'm surprised. Yeah, I know. I'm so... I am so glad the chainsaw at least regenerates. I honestly didn't... I did, honestly didn't know it would do that until, like, halfway through the game. Like, I was, like, halfway through the game before I realized, oh, if you have no fuel in your chainsaw, it auto-refills. Alright. Now we got a frag grenade. Also, I don't want to sound indifferent or something like that, but, um, but, uh, I, I honestly don't enjoy playing the battle mode that they introduced in this game. I'd rather just have normal deathmatch, to be honest. I know I feel, I mean, like, I don't want to bring up a sour note and be like that, but... I'm dodging. Shit. Fucking ha I swear, yeah, I just also have just- I also just have bad aim. That's another one of my issues. I am playing on Xbox, so you know I- I'm doing this on controller. Honestly, I'd bet battle mode would be more enjoyable if you're playing it with people that, uh, that you know. Because I've only been able to just play it with randos. Because I don't know a whole lot of people who have this game. Fuck off. Oh, shit. This is shit. Anything I hate more is just getting caught on shit. Um, I probably don't even need to kill this guy now that I think about it. All right. Yeah, for those of you who are watching this on YouTube, um, basically the game has like a certain flow to it. Like, honestly, I love this game's flow compared to 2016. Um, if you want health, you go for glory kills. If you want armor, then you att then you set enemies on fire. If you want ammo, you chainsaw them. Like, that's basically the game loop that we follow in this. All right.
I do love this ember. I do love this ember skin for uh, series one of unlocks, though. This ember skin is dope. I don't know. I just like the color black. Fuck off. I also have to be aware of the tentacles, too. There we go. Yeah, I pretty much remembered which ones come out of the hole. Yeah, I really love the classic skin. I really do. The classic skin is awesome. Though, since Doom 64 was the actual first uh, Doom game that I ever played, I kind of like the 64 look more, personally. Which I'm so glad Doom 64 is back. I've been playing it and I forgot how much fun that game is. All right, let's go. Okay, I kind of went in front of that one. That's my B. Get over here. Okay, get you. Get you. All right, back up. Fuck. Fuck. He's on the prowl. Son of a bitch. Fucking Arach Arachnatron just got me from behind all of a sudden. Okay. It's just me. Yeah, I'm in panic mode. I'm in panic mode. Back up. Give me ammo. All right. <sighs> oh, man. Ooh. Oh, that's cool. Yeah. I remember when my friends introduced me to Wolfenstein 3D. I bought that shit on the back on the 360, and I played the shit out of it. Wolfenstein 3D is good. I love New Order and the New Colossus as well. Those are real. Those are like just as good. Oh yeah, and with the lore they follow up in this game, Doom 2016 totally, totally takes place after Doom 64. I always had a feeling. Honestly, I'm glad I get to play Doom 64 with a controller that has two sticks. Lol. That's honestly the best part about it. Just take my word for it, playing Doom 64 with a with a 64 controller is fucking terrible. But I mean, I did it nonetheless. Like if you wanted to strafe, there was a button you had to hold. You had to hold like right the right C button. Fuck. 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 
Thank God for grenades, dude. Okay, I need to back the hell up. Back it up, back it up! Whew. Okay. Oh, the original Dawes game, okay. Uh, I need to do glory kills. I need health back. Yeah, I took your shit out. Okay. Where the fuck you going? Back here. All right, level one is done. Thank God. She is inside that demonic citadel. I will mark her location on your hunt. Really? That's interesting. Okay, um, yes. Okay. is located just above your location. My scans indicate there is a lift at the center of this facility. And also, I'm using the UAC uh, UI color right now. In any case you're wondering why my HUD elements look like a different color, that's what I have it set to. It just looks the nicest. And yes, I got the classic wet, the you classic shotgun skin. You cannot interfere. This is humanity's chance to repent, to give service to us. You cannot resist the will of the Khan Maker. Activating the portal now. For it was you who was meant to enforce it. Uh, hold on one sec. Hold on one second.
Sorry about that. I'm wondering what that banging was. Ugh. Yeah, see, I'm already I've already almost got everything on series one already. Oof. Okay, so it like took me 30 minutes to get through like level one. Now, level two, this one's gonna be interesting. I feel like the micro missiles is better at the start because it has better damage potential than the scope does. The reason why I wanna try and do Ultra Nightmare is that you actually get something out of it in this game. You actually get a golden skin for the Doom Slayer. I do not have the means to locate the second Hell Priest. Your celestial locator is missing a component. We will need a replacement. I've completed the redesign of your equipment launcher. The flame belch is now ready for your approval. Great, now I can get armor. Okay, now I'm trying to think what's more important to get right now. <sighs> this is what I need to figure out. Mm, let's see. Do I probably want to have more armor? Like, should I try and get my armor like up to the same level as my health is? Because I think survivability is more important than inventory. So I probably won't do ammo right out the gate. Let's see. Hmm. Flame belch takes less time to cool down. I feel like that's gonna that's gonna be a deciding factor. So yeah, I'm gonna boost armor right here. And then I'll boost health right next to it so I can get that perk. The portal is activated and ready when you are. We are going. You know, I was going to get artwork done for a Doom 2016 Let's Play. But it ended up not happening because the person I commissioned just, like, I paid them and they didn't send me anything for, like, for, like, like, like four or five months. And then I was asking for a refund. They finally got back to me. And, I mean, I still haven't gotten the refund yet either. Eh, it happens. That's funny, I just start level 2 and suddenly I do not remember this. <laughs> Sooner I get dashed, the better. I think the first suit upgrade I should get should be like dash refills more quickly. Because I, I, want, I want to zip around everywhere. Because if I'm zip ar zipping around all the damn place, then I'm less likely to get hit. Alright, first fight of level 2. Let's see how I do this. Fuck. I know, this is where I'm gonna start get it. Yeah, this is where I'm gonna start fighting Hell Knights now. Alright, there we go. Whew. Now I got Blood Punch. Hell yeah. Alright, uh, there is one up behind me. No. 
I can get over to it. At least the enemy's health doesn't change. I'm happy about that. Because if, if their health actually got higher, then it'd be fucking insane. Okay, um, let's see. I'm just trying to think what's more important right now. I never actually use the slow down time one. Hmm. Normally, I always get longer stagger. That way, I have more time to deal with other shit while they're... Well, while, like, while, while I'm busy fighting other shit, the bigger guys that are more of a problem, I can do all right fighting. So... All right, um... Okay, we're gonna go for that right now, and next rune, I will get the slowdown time. Alright, um... Okay, there is something. There is something below. Because if stuff stays out of commission for, like, even, like, like, a few seconds longer, then that's just gonna help in the long run. That Mega Sphere there, I'm not gonna grab that until after the fight down there is over. I want that toy. I want all of these toys in real life. Boom. Okay, let's go. God, the music is so sick. I'm also happy that a bunch of the weapons got their classic looks back. Like the plasma rifle, looks like the OG plasma rifle. Okay, I kind of messed that up. I mean, uh, I'll probably... Uh, I mean, like, is it... Will I be able to come back here? I don't think I will. I'm just wondering if I... It'd probably be smarter to just save that... Mega Sphere. But, nah, I'm gonna pick it up anyway. God damn it, and I already lost it. Great. Aren't I just good at this game? Or what? Okay, fuck you. Fuck, for real? That's just, that's just bull. That's bullshit, is what that is. Okay, I need to get you. Screw you. Screw you. I totally forgot that I need to be flame belching shit. I'm not doing that. Ah, oh, crap. Alright, come on. Son of a bitch. I'm so glad I can insta uh, cock demons. That's so good. I'm so glad you can do that. Yeah, more distance. Yeah, that's what I did my first time, too. That's why I couldn't figure out what to do with the third one. Okay, this shit is getting annoying. There we go. Fuck your shit. Fuck you. Get out of here. OK. 
okay. Okay. And also, I need to figure out what to put my weapon points into. Because, again, I just, I'm just not 100% sure where to even go with that. And also secret encounters. Well, I need to get dash first before I can even get over there. Nads, nads. Isn't there... Yeah, there is something behind me. I guess the armor increase is, is more worth it because I'm not wasting armor pickups. Okay, um... There we go. Give me my precious. Yeah, I think Long Distance Glory Kill might be my next one. And my third one will probably be the Time Slowdown. In the air. Why are you transgressions against the Covenant, they are still of sentinel blood. What you interfere with now is bigger than you can imagine. It is written. It is their time to give penance. If you continue, you will bring down the Heaven's wrath. You are but one man. They are no longer your people to save. I just love how the whole game, he's just like, do you think I give a fuck? They killed my pet rabbit. The demons killed my pet rabbit, so now they all have to die. That's the rule. Yeah, I thought there was something under there, but there wasn't. Right now the water's fucking electrified. Son of a bitch. Come on, bring it. Fuck. 
Nice, that's all right. Now I have to start obeying environmental rules. This is bullshit. Come on, let's go, let's go. Fuck you. Give me health. Did I see another one running here? Yep, 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 yep. Just take it one at a time. Let's go, let's go, let's go. God fucking damn it! Okay. Fuck. Okay. We good. Oh boy. That was a little... That was a little scary. This sentinel battery can be used to provide additional power to your ship. Several modules remain unused. Finding more batteries will enable you to utilize the full functions of your command station. Luckily, luckily this secret encounter is easy. Got two cacodemons. I'm gonna let them get closer to me. There we go. Booyah. That's how you do it. That's still locked. Okay. Can't I just like? Okay, yeah. Let's not do anything reckless right now. I think we're doing good so far. And now we got a plasma rifle. Let's go. And now we got revenants. Fuck. Was not expecting that. There we go. Is that it? Okay, hold on. Hold on a tad second. I hate it when y'all do that drop-in shit. I hate it. My armor. 
Y'all can all go to hell. Literally. Go back to whence you came. Alright, and I think that's it. Now, I remember there being a cracked wall somewhere. Took me over here. From below. So... Oh yeah, that's right. Thing I have to punch that has no icon. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Also, I love how it's playing the intermission music from the original. I really love that. And now I've got to deal with tentacles again. Oh, suck ass. Took all, like all my armor away. Of course they did. Because you can't move around in this shit and it sucks. See? Like, that's some horse shit. What do you expect me to do to that? Do I suddenly- do I just have something that can help me get past them? Like, do I have to just wait for my chainsaw to refuel? Is that it? See, that death was completely uncalled for and it was bullshit. Okay, I need to figure out what to go from here. I think I need precision bolt at this point. There is a sentinel power core nearby. Yep. You can use it to activate the mech and clear a path forward. Making sure I'm not missing anything. That was not my intention, but I will take it anyway. God, I just love this intermission music. Makes me just want to listen to it. It's all day. Now, isn't there something? Yeah, there's a crack right there. Megasphere. There's a note, there's a note page over here. How did I not see that? Is this where I get bombarded? Z 
They when I'm playing also when I'm playing through Ultra Nightmare, I'm questioning whether or not to do the Slayer Gates because I think if you die in the Slayer Gates, then you just it's just over, right? I feel like the Slayer Gates would not be worth doing in Ultra Nightmare. It's too risky. Too risque. Fuck. Fucking missiles. Missile shooting douche. Of course shit can get up here. Fuck. What's the best thing? Where the fuck is everything? Where do I even? Okay, missiles. He fired them. There they are. Fuck. You see, I suck at aiming. I suck at quick scoping. It's not my strong suit. I always take time to line up my shots. Not like this. Not like this. I refuse to die up here away from them. I am not that much of a pleb. No way. See, this is just sad. There we go. There we go. Let's go. And here comes a Hell Knight. Great. Last thing, definitely the last thing I need to put up with right now. Get fucked. Oh, god damn it. For real? I just died instantaneously and I didn't even know what caused it. What in the hell? I feel like there's just a lot of random elements that that you just have to be uh, prepared for even though there's like no preparation for it at all. Like you can just die like out of nowhere just for no reason. Like, are you telling me that my skill has to go past RNG? Like, what? Why? Why does it have to be like that? What? Oh my fucking god. And I fall off. Of course I fall off. Okay, this room's gonna fucking suck. I, like, haven't had much trouble with any of the other rooms until now. Maybe I should have used the plasma rifle more. Where's this last bastard at? There he is. Lame. Also, I don't know if the secret encounters would be worth doing unless they can be done, like, relatively quickly. But I guess I'll find out.
And personally, I don't know if the Unmaker would be worth getting, either. I mean, the Unmaker is dope as shit. Just, it, I just love it because it, it's a Doom 64 weapon, but... Just all that flesh. All that flesh. Honestly, when you think about it, this shit must stink really bad. Oh, god damn it. The buff totems. This is where it gets introduced, isn't it? Nope. The ammo. Hello. Fuck. Think like what? There's like two encounters left. Okay, this is just horse shit. This is just straight up horse shit. You just straight up expect me to just deal with this motherfucker with no movement. time with this. I feel like my plasma rifle kind of out outweighs my uh my assault rifle. My assault rifle would probably only be good for sniping. Am I missing anything? Got this giant energy core. I'm not walking in that shit. I mean, there's a crystal down here. That'd be worth it. But... Yeah, I've got chainsaw fuel. What do you mean, no target? Oh, that's just dumb. Um, We're going for help.
Okay. There's only one. So far, I've died twice in this level. That's not a good thing. Snipe that from there. Oh, hey there. Okay, there is something over there, but I can't get there at the moment, I think. Son of a bitch. Save myself at least. Oh, okay, yeah. Ah, Megasphere. Good old Megasphere. There's something under there? No, that's not even part of the map. I was about to say, I don't even remember where I'm going. Whew. Fuck. All right. Oh, there is? Fuck. Ah! No, 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 no. Okay. All right, I'll take your word for it. Oh. What? Okay, all right. I never even knew this existed. This is just throwback, obviously. Is that all it did? Okay. Neat. I never knew that was there. I was wondering where like the retro references were. Uh, I found it. Thank you for that. I would have never found that. I mean, I would have never ever found that. I would never have known. Also, don't forget, there's a milestone for punching the Slayer Gate. There's a milestone for that. Fuck. Anything else? Anybody else wants to fuck with me? Alright. That leads down, this leads up. Uh... Yeah, because it's like so out of place. Though I did love unlocking the retro maps and being able to play them, like in their entirety in uh, 2016. I thought that was cool. I will pick up the Slayer key at least. Because it is a collectible. I know if I were to go take on a Slayer Gate now, I'd get fucking destroyed. I just don't have enough shit to hold my own. The entire's life signal is nearby. 
the betrayer's light signal. Oh, did you know your son? The betrayer. I just want to tell you now. Did you know that your son is the final boss of the initial Earth Hell invasion from the second game? Were you aware of this? Yeah, I made it up here. Pretty sure I didn't do anything, though. Nope. And I'm still farting. Okay, um... Alright. What do you say, boyo? There are motion sensors and artillery everywhere. Slayer, when his heart is laid to rest, then his soul will be at peace. And so will mine. Motherfucker be talking about the icon of sin. Fuck. See, that's just me being a goddamn moron. Okay, it put me back up here. Because, I mean, like, I should have just waited until I got uh, fast travel. Come over here. Okay, that's nothing. Son of a bitch. Um. Oh, it's on this platform. I'm an idiot. Yeah, demon. Fall straight down. You must defeat me, John Romero. See, with my health the way it is now, I'm just gonna get my ass kicked. Just because I don't remember how to find shit. Yeah, if I'm coming up to the final encounter. This is gonna suck. I found everything. Yes. The extraction point has been identified. I will mark its location on your HUD. You know, um, okay, I get I have ten weapon points right now. Now I need to figure out what I can do with that. I can launch a bunch of sticky bombs. I mean that sounds really good. But getting mastery over it's a pain in the ass. I mean, the full auto just almost feels useless on nor on nightmare. You're not dealing enough damage. Um, I mean, micro missiles are nice, but I'm not using them as much as I want to. I feel like sticky bombs the only the only thing I can do right now. Okay, 
I just made them more lethal. More reliable. That motherfucker's trying to snipe me from here. What an asshole. Look at that shit. He's trying to fucking snipe me. Fine, you want to play that game? Fuck you. Okay, he's dead. Mm, okay, I got that one up. I'm going this way. Okay, I need to grab those med kits. All right, here we go. Let's do this shit. Fuck, and I fucking fall down here. I fall here every fucking time. Fuck. All right. Okay, yeah. I had no idea what I could do about that. And also, it's taking way, way too fucking long for my dash to recharge. I need to get dash re I need to get quicker dash refill like as soon as possible. Okay, see, that's just dumb. I've already died in this one spot twice. Was this another instance of the developers weren't able to beat Ultra Nightmare? I feel like it's almost like that. Okay. Yeah, I know. If only I had the super shotgun this fucking early. But no, I have to start off weak like this. Almost fell in the goddamn lava again. Where? Where's that coming from? There you are. Okay, so I died like four or five times. Yeah, if it weren't for the fact that the chainsaw just decides to miss when you lock on when you're like locked on to something. Ah fuck, there is one thing I missed. Oh yeah, it was the Empyrean key. Never mind. I don't have to get those. Yeah, but I mean, like, I don't like to try and drag shit out like that because there are so many times when I'm playing a game to drag something out that it all ends up being for nothing. Like, that's what I try to avoid, but I guess it's probably a lot better. Not to mention, I just don't have the maps memorized, so I always end up dashing. Like you saw, I dashed myself, like, off, like, off into the lava. Like, I dash myself, I try to keep myself moving, like, everywhere, but I always either run into a wall or fall down a pit. I always do either that or the other one. Former or the latter. I'm just not doing, I'm just not doing that good. I died, like, four or five times on that level. There's no way that's gonna pass. At all. You can now find the remaining health priests by activating... 
activating your celestial locator. The second Hell Priest is located in the northern region of Earth. I will calibrate the portal now. The hub has several areas locked off due to power constraints. Once power has been restored, you will be able to access the entire ship. I just wish that there were enemies that... Establishing power to core and supplementary systems. I mean, honestly, I just wish that there was fucking. I just wish that there was like, like, the fact that I want a chainsaw shit, but like most of the shit that gives me trouble needs three chainsaw fuel. Your equipment launcher has been completed. Once fired, the bomb will douse nearby enemies in freezing gases. You'll have to manually toggle the launcher to fire either ice bombs or frag grenades. Oh, wait, great. Now I have to go down there and punish the demons. You know what? I'm going to do that later. I'm going to go ahead and end the stream now. Because, ugh. Getting a little stressed out. <laughs> Alright, let's see. I'm still at level 1. On that set. Oh, I got EXP. All right. All right. All right, that's going to be it for this stream. So for those of you watching on YouTube, check out my Twitch. Those of you on U on Twitch, check out my YouTube. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed watching this, watching me suffer and fail miserably. And I will see you guys on the next video slash stream. Till then, see you then.